cunts here. Yeah, you did say this was more of a hobby for me. That's exactly it. The only people coming in are our friends like Madachi and Sacha. Which means that legend malt is probably just gonna sit behind the counter for the rest of our lives. Oh, it's not yours. Over nothing. Oh, I feel better already. Well, I don't know if you should be that relaxed about it. It's not like he'd carry something he was never gonna sell. Welcome. No. What a lovely little establishment you have. Your first time in, sir? It is. See? He does get actual customers. First time I've seen a first-timer. I've heard some rumors about this place from some good sources. Oh, yeah? Rumors about what? That you carry the fabled whiskey known as the Legend Vault. Ah, <gasps> uh, well, then the rumors are true. Pour me a glass, then, bartender. If anyone can appreciate such a thing, it's me. Huh. It's mine. What now? What can we do? <laughs> you, you, you have to, you have to. Fuck it. The money. You'll be an even deeper shit if he drinks that. I really must apologize, but my legend malt isn't for sale. Why would that be? Is it reserved for your regulars? Not exactly. I just don't think you're fit to order it. Excuse me. <laughs> you say this knowing I'm the editor in chief of Good Dandy? He's from Good Dandy? No way. What the hell is that? that? It's a rich man's magazine full of nice cars and swanky restaurants. Well, that's terribly unfortunate. For you, if you had even a modicum of customer service, I'd have written you an absolutely dazzling review. Put me in your magazine or don't. That's your call to make. Believe you me, I'll be giving you the front page. Everyone's going to know about the snob running this backwater hole. This year.